Hello my wonderful pair bears and welcome back to another episode of the Deck Gates Challenge. We are still in the 1890s. And each decade is over 10 years. I don't have to explain that. I don't know why I explained it to you. I just did. I'm sorry guys. But we are still of course on the Sullivan family and I'm just going to give you a quick recap on what the rules of this challenge are. When we're starting up, we have to start with a young adult or older. There's no restrictions in the cast. However, dressing them up is appropriate decades clothes is recommended. So I did download a lot of custom content in order to deal with this, the, the dress attire. If I can remember where I downloaded them from, I will link them in the description for you guys. Um, if you choose to make two sims, they must be married or they're getting married. And you've seen from the very first episode, we had them elope because it just don't work properly for me. So, let's get going. In the house, housing and funds, your starter money can only be 16k. You have to buy any land slash house with it. You can import a house from the gallery, but only if you can afford it. You can start by living in an apartment. However, when you get married and have kids, you must move out. Apartments were not idealistic places for families in the 1890s, as they were reserved for the single and working. So, for the 1890s, we have to... Only male heirs are allowed. If there are no boys, then a woman's husband will inherit all of the family money. Sims may only have a relationship and marry with the opposite gender. So, of course, back then, love wasn't love. Okay. Um, Sims may only marry with their own eth um, ethnicity and slash race. Yes, okay. Sims must only thrive for a baby and never just woo hoo. Hence why they already have four kids and why I am planning a further two. Teenage, teenage Sims cannot mess around. There's no electricity and you can only use candles or lanterns to light up the house. Women take care of the children, tidy the house and cook. They can help tidy the garden and go jogging for fun. Men can only have the entertainer, doctor or criminal career if otherwise men can choose to stay at home and work. Make money through woodworking, painting and gardening. You can open a retail store or restaurant only if you have enough money. Now I did some research into this guys and there was other careers available back then. And yeah, it wasn't in the challenge, so I, manual labour was one of them, where, do you know, like, they'd work for other farmers and stuff like that, for the extra cash. I did have him have a manual labouring job at the start, but we haven't actually used it much. I don't think he's actually even gone to them at the weekend. Uh, Sims cannot get divorced unless one of them commits adultery, in this case, flirting with another Sim in front of the spouse. If a woman becomes widowed, they can earn money through painting, gardening, or woodworking. If she becomes divorced, they can earn money through the entertainer career. We all know what career that is. You know, the girls who do the dancing in the saloon? Did I say that right? I think I did. High school has a fee. It costs $1,000 for, for every teenager going to school. University is okay. You might want to install a mod to reduce the amount of credits needed to graduate university. Female children move out once they are married and there's an optional yoke. I'd recommend downloading a teenage slash pregnancy slash marriage mod or some other mod that where teenagers can have pregnancy. So you can get married and have a child when you are a teenager because I do have the MC Command um, Center mod, which means we can do that if we choose to go down that path. Um, I'm not sure yet because a young adult is still a kid between the age of 18 to I think 40. And then like uh, adult is like from 40 to 65 and then your elder is from 65 upwards. Um, I'm trying to keep the math in my head. Cell phones are, not allow, um, are only allowed to invite people over to your house or to travel. Only bathtubs, no showers. Outside toilets only. Optional for more realistic details. Don't use any of the glass roofs. I haven't. I only have wooden furniture. We only have wooden floors and walls. We have no drywall or wallpaper. We have the cheapest stove and fridge encounters. No other kitchen appliances are allowed besides the stove and the fridge. Only impressionists or classic paintings are allowed to be hung. Kids' drawings can only be hung in the kids' rooms. If your sims get sick, you can give them medicine. You have to cure them through natural remedies. Uh, your sims may not throw any events besides weddings. Every child born during this decade must be born at home. They can only be fed through breastfeeding and not by bottle. If your family can afford it, they can hire a butler or maid. However, you cannot hire a nanny. 
Also, you probably want to start working on a cow plant in this decade. We have done that. We've got two cow plants. We have a fully grown one and we have a baby one. I'm sorry if I'm doing so much talking at the start of this. But this is our beautiful girl, um, Laura Beth. She's actually my favourite at the moment. And she's just happy. Why are you happy? Bright side of life. Cozy fire. Um, sparkling clean surroundings. So, of course, Caroline is doing an awesome job. And homework champion. So, she's completed her homework. Baby is um, somehow not happy. Okay. I know what's wrong. Change the baby's diaper. Of course, a bit of breastfeeding. Cool. And we'll just rock as well. And that has her doing. Charles is out talking, of course, to his firstborn son, which is Charles Jr. We also, of course, have little John, who is so, is behind his dad playing with the dollhouse. And we have Laura Beth is our firstborn daughter, who will, of course, be the first to be moved out. She, back then, you know, mothers, uh, all women were teachers. I think that was right, yeah. Um, but yeah, I am so happy with that. I'm not happy about this. It had to have glitched out. There is no way. We didn't have him long enough for him to die. So this must have glitched somehow. But it's still telling me we have a dog. I have to check. Yeah, it says Jack's still alive. And that we can invite him over. I, I just don't get this. But yeah, I'm, I have, um, of course, Charles doing painting. But I might have Caroline do it as well. So that, you know, she can... Is it classic or what is it? I'm going to just double check the painting. Uh, do, 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 do. Impressionists or classic paintings can be hung in the house. So I'm just going to have her doing painting. And she can decorate the house walls with those kind of paintings. And yeah, that is those rules of art. For the next um, one, which of course Charles Jr. will be uh, the heir, um, we've got a longer list of things to do and we have to have the cow plants for that because it says uh all right you know what we'll, we'll come to that when we have to come to that okay so let's get going okay so charles you still have a lot of work to do on the garden okay please stop doing that um yeah and like with it also becoming awesome it is awesome. Okay, so tomorrow is a little Mary's birthday. The day after that is little John's birthday. And then we come to our very first holiday, which of course, guys, is Harvest Fest. So it's like Thanksgiving, okay? Oh girl, do not be playing with that. Please, please don't, 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 don't. Maybe I should have that in a locked up area. Okay, you should probably send this little girl home um, just so she does not, um, do something. So we're going to feed our chickens and we're going to look for eggs. And yeah, I should really get going now. You should, you should, you should, you should. Um, this guy is really angry at the dollies. Okay. Okay, okay. I should have Caroline then, of course, come and calm down this little man. Um, what is it, like toddlers? I think it's just like, um, a genuine, uh, what is it, like, did you talk snuggle? Um, let's start practicing, you're hiding. What is your parenting skill, actually? You are nearly level 10 parenting, nearly level 10 knitting and cooking and gardening and baking. We are doing awesome with these skills okay so the aim of this of course um is to actually make sure that charles jr makes it to who are you kamuka and all i'm sorry but we don't talk to strangers so we're just gonna send you one home okay okay so caroline is out here painting Charles is just doing his normal duties as a farmer. We're going to check, actually, do I still... Oh, no. no, we have him as self-employed. He's a farmer slash crafter. That's pretty cool. Because, you know, it has to be that way. 
see if we can have him craft any more things. We'll get into another shelf. We're gonna have to have him actually do you know what? I think we can have our kids break leaves. Okay, awesome. Charles Jr., you're gonna learn learn what it's like to live on a farm and you get to decide if this is what you wanna do. Laura Beth, you're gonna help your mum out and you're gonna help No no don't make the mess. I want you to clean up the mess, okay? Baby is crying again. Change your diaper. Let's go. That actually looks pretty nice. Ooh, it's very old styled as well. So it could be perfect, guys. It could be perfect for this. I think about adding a new little tweak to this as well. For each gen I do, I should have the the, the decade up in the corner. So because we're in the 1890s to 1900s, I think we're just putting a little bit of the text in the top corner, and I might do that. I might, if it's on it, then you know I followed through with it. If not, then please write me in the comments. And of course, guys, if you are only joining the Pay Bear Squad, make sure you have clicked that subscribe button and turn on your notification bell so you're told every time I upload a new video. And then you'll be part of the Pear Bear Squad. I try to keep it lively here. I, I do try. <laughs> I try very hard, but it isn't finished. Karen's hard work has paid off and her mushroom plant has increased. Ooh, that really should be Charles. Okay. So I'm just going to slow down the old clock here. What time have we got? Wow, okay, these kids should be in bed. Wow, you are doing an awesome job, Charles Jr. Oh, get you back. And up you go to bed. Okay. So you need to get yourself to bed and Laura Beth, you need to get yourself to bed as well. You've got school in the morning. Sweet little John, I would love it if you would just pop your ass off into bed. Charles, when you are done, you need to go to bed as well. You are up at the crack of dawn in the morning. And he is already like acting as if he's going to sleep. Charles Jr., you are finished with the um, raking. I'm just going to have you go on to bed. This painting is excellent quality. So we are going to go and pop this into the house and have our first painting. There we go. Oh, wow, I love it. I love, 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 love it. Kids are all off to bed. And the man is stinker. He is stank. Charles, have you gone out to the leaves? You have, my boy. Okay, this really is not what I said, but okay. I shall drag to here. Now, Charles, um, you're going to have to have your wife out today. Um, Jack Toddler. Okay. Our girl is so fast asleep. Oh, she's awake. Okay. The good days from good toddlerhood and sparkling clean surroundings. Okay, girl. You are of course hungry. Please go help yourself to some breakfast. Um did you complete your homework? You did, but you did not complete your project. And you have some time. You actually have some time. Although the the project things they didn't do them. Oh <gasps> Carl moved to level ten of parenting. It's also a little Mary birthday, so we can actually age her up now if we want. Okay. Okay. Um, so our beautiful little girl can now be aged up. It is her birthday. I'm going to show you now, guys. It is her birthday. So we've got another toddler. Here we go. Beautiful little girl. Okay. All right. Okay. So we're going to randomize. Okay. We've got inquisitive, curious explorers. These toddlers gain thinking skills slightly faster. They are happy when learning something and sad if they haven't learned anything lately. Toddlers. They spend playing with toys, exploring the world and learning to communicate with words inside instead of tears. Oh wait. This is the perfect time to start skill building for the future. Okay. That's a, it's a very curious color. But that's just... Since four guys, it's gonna make this a lot deadly. So, let's go and pull her into cat and move on. And here she is. 
she is guys and she's so adorable she's kind of cross i don't know why but she's having fun with her mom there we go look and she's adorable i think caroline is very beautiful there we go okay so it's her done let's go see what's around with this guy Dude, I didn't tell you to do that. I asked you, actually asked you to go to the bathroom and get something to eat. Off you go. Charles, what are you up to? Your son's not listening to me, so you might as well just do play with and pet this cute little cow plant. <laughs> and then when you're done with that, I need you to start getting rid of a bunch of leaves. Okay, where was I? Alright, you need to go and clean all of that up. Boy, you need to go and get something to eat after you have deflowered the bush. Okay. They all have school in an hour. Okay. You just really need to go and get some food. Did you not just go to toilet? Let's see. Okay. Um, she is such a good bean. She is such a good bean. Okay. So, lovely little John, he ages up tomorrow. Okay, so I'm going to have them both go to school now. And where is Caroline? Okay. Oh, she's still spending time with little Mary. Parenting. Let's teach her to say thank you, Matt. Little John is still a sheep. Okay. Oh wow, okay. Well, right, we have to go and hang all of this stuff out. Oh, and Charles has work to be doing. Okay, but let's go in supercell everything. Let's water everything. Let's weed everything. Let's supercell everything. Okay. Right, I'm going to fast guard everything. Kids actually should be heading to school right now. Oh, all right, no, let her keep going to school. Off you go. Okay. Have her work, listen to the teacher. And you're off to school as well. Okay, you need to start the house stuff. Okay, both kids have gone to school. I'm going to have him also listen to the teacher because his father wants the best for him. You're doing the laundry. I'm actually going to have you go and help with the garden today. Okay. Right, okay, let go. Do you want to well? Thank you, my dear. Where are you going back? Oh, for the love of. Here we go. Alright, you're going to help Charles sell all. Okay. I'm going to have her go and as well do another painting. Uh, classic painting. Let's go do the medium one. Okay. For some reason, like, when I go to her, it like, doesn't let me take care of things. So I'm just going to leave that. I'm just going to leave that. Okay. Okay, sweetheart. Okay, are you... You're hungry. I'm not going to have a splash in that. Caroline, I need you to make some food. Right, resume the garden solid. She is level 6 now, gardening. Um... Ooh, we have some apples on this tree, so I'm gonna have her um, harvest the apples. Okay. Little worry, we is hungry. Okay, so I'm gonna see them grab some food out of the fridge for her. Okay. You can go up and dear. Can you grab this? Eat the ham dinner. Good girl. Got some strawberries as well. Good man, Charles. Okay, we've got all of this done. 
I do need him to go and supercell all of the lemons. Supercell. Oh, supercell. We've got lots of money coming to us now. Let's go. Let's go. Anything from these trees? No. Ooh. George Cowhole passed away. Um, okay. Tend. And read all. Okay. Um, our beautiful 1900s cow is fine. What is Caroline doing? She's painting. Okay. Got some, what is it, grey and black crew socks. Oh, she can give them as gifts. Little John is still sleeping. Okay, John, you need to get up. Uh, Caroline, we need to do some potty training today. You gotta potty train, potty train little John, and I'm gonna have this little lady after. Did you eat? Where are you? Did you not eat the dinner? Oh my god, she did, and it didn't fill her. Um, okay, let's get something else. Um, get tomato soup. Can you eat some of this tomato soup? Give me a dear. Um, it's going to get very confusing very quickly. Okay, she's going to have some tomato soup. And then she is going to have a sleep in John's bed while he comes and plays with dolls. Um, do oh, what did I brush? Okay, I need you to move on. Is this done? Okay, so this is coming inside. Charles' responsibility trait is in range. Okay. Are you feel? Oh, that's more of a kitchen painting. Here we go. What are you doing? Harvest the apples. Okay. Um, I do really need you to replace the water here. We also got to clean him. You have to fight right now. Okay. Charles, are you finished your work? I don't know, for some reason I feel like you're not. I'm hoping I'm wrong. Oh wow, okay, you got everything. Oh wow, okay, you got everything. You didn't. Supercell, come on. One of these are sparkling, but it won't let me. Which one? Oh, I give up. Uh, right, okay. Caroline can, oh, okay, let her, yeah, okay, let her invite over her friend. Okay. There we go. Ooh, wait, 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 grades are up. Who is it? Are you the grade B? And Laura Beth is the grade B. Oh, she's the daughter. I don't remember putting this up on her, but I must have. Okay. So... I'm thinking we should invest in a swing. I'd like it to be one of the like a tire swing, but I don't think I have any two that will resemble an a tire swing. So we're gonna see if we get a swing. Um good, okay, we have that one. Although I think I would love a wood one. Have we any wooden ones? Okay, we have this one. This looks like it could have just been put together. Like with that wood. Okay, like at least this way the kids have something to entertain themselves. And we can pretend dad put you know put it together for them. Probably here. I don't like these um all oh, these leaves are driving me insane. So at least like they can go and she can swing with her friend. Okay, go see meet your friend, good girl. Um, okay, Caroline, how soon's going? Right, I'm gonna have you tuck in. And let's um, dress him. 
toddler care, change his outfit to his everyday. Oh wow, he's level 6. Okay. Okay, so I'm just gonna um, sort out their needs and we're gonna... Let's wrap back up. Yeah, so I just kind of got swung back to the house. These two are at it and I'm just gonna go. I'm hoping it's... Um, Okay, I just, I pleasantly satisfied, okay. So, I don't even know if this was done for fun or what. Why are you uncomfortable from nausea and stomach gurgles? Did you eat something that was off? Okay, do you need to get sick in order to feel better? No, you're fine. Who are you? <gasps> no way, Louise aged up and she's no clothes on. She aged up. When is your birthday? Because you're supposed to be like the same age. I was aging them up last night when they got A's. I'm not going to do that anymore. I'm just going to let the, it come when their birthdays come. It's more realistic. How is Caroline doing? She seems fine. She really needs to pee. Okay, let's get her to go to the toilet. Wait, what? All right, I think these are always on it, so I'm, I have nothing to worry about there. Um, polish this to perfection. Um, can we upgrade yet? No, we cannot. I'm just gonna use the toilet, and then I'm just gonna have her sleep. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna send everybody off to sleep now, and we're gonna call this an episode. So, guys, if you've been enjoying the decade challenge and would like to see more of these, make sure you have clicked that subscribe button and you turn on the notification bell so you're told every time I upload a new episode. And I want to say happy, happy Tuesday to my beautiful Pear Bear gang, and I shall see you guys all in another episode. Bye. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on that notification bell for all of my future uploads. Love you.